They said that there's going to be like five. Which is another thing that annoys the crap out of me, people. Let's wait until the movie does well and then make the five movies, okay? This is like, this is Avatar and it's four sequels all over again, people. We don't even know how the Avatar sequel is going to do. Not that Avatar, Andrea, the blue ones. Yes, I know what you're talking about. Well, you just kind of gave me that look of, I'm talking about Avatar slash Korra. No, no. No, I'm it's... not talking about that. I knew you're, which yeah, one you Yeah, the, the James Cameron one. Yeah, because I remember you saying that. Because freaking heck, man. Just make the sequel. Let's see if the sequel's good. And then at that point, you can decide to make number three. You have people literally signed to like five movies now. They have to show up. Yes, I want to use this on the crank. Yay! I fixed it. And now Atlas must bear his burden. He must bear the world on his shoulders. And now with that, we go upstairs to take that pain off his shoulders. Oh, I didn't realize I had a fan club. Can I get your autograph? Are you Kratos? Can I get your autograph, please? Sure, let me just carve it. Into your skin. Oh, that's okay, man. And kill you in the process. That, that puts a whole new definition to sign my boob. Don't give me that look. People do that still. I've seen it done many, many times, especially with, with people like Chris Evans and Chris Hemsworth. It happens. The Twilight guys were doing it plenty. Will you please sign my chest? Why, sure, little missy. That sounded wrong now that I think about it. Why don't you stop me in moments like that? I don't know. I think it would be completely within your right to do so. But then what would people think when I stop you at everything? Because you're trying to halt my free speech? No, she's trying to make, make me not do something stupid. Do something stupid. Oh! It's time for us to open the door to the shrine of the silver monkey. No, not really. We're just going to the end of the trial of Atlas. And if you don't know who Atlas is, go look up your local Greek mythology at your local library. Butterfly in the sky, I can go twice as high. Just take a look, it's in a book, a reading a rainbow. I don't know where that came from. Uh, I don't so know. we have another one. My youngest son will laugh no more, death in the service of his father. Death in the service of the gods, the building of this temple has claimed his life. May you be lucky enough that it, that it not claim yours. Pathos Verdes III, chief architect and loyal subject of the gods. And poor Pathos Verdes, well, I have to open up his son's crypt. Son's coffin. For no other reason then. Well, I need to borrow something from you, buddy. And that would be your head. Ah! Oh, there we go. So now I have the architect's son's head. Because I'm a nice guy like that. Wee! Just let me drop for crying out loud. Thank you. I don't need any of this. Where am I? I ended up in a different place. Where did we go, Andrea? I don't know. I don't know either. We're at a place of some kind. Oh. Oh. Uh. Hi, guys. Uh, was I supposed to save you? I think I screwed up. 
The wrecked bodies oh. of those who had gone in search of Pandora's box lay before him. And at once, Kratos knew who was responsible. For this was not the first time he'd seen the ruined Ares and his minions had left in their wake. Kratos had experienced it firsthand years before. The youngest and boldest captain in the Spartan army, Kratos inspired fierce loyalty in his men. It had always been enough to carry them through any battle until this day. The barbarians to the east numbered in the thousands and descended on the Spartans without mercy. I am trying to be Hawkeye! Mm. The battle lasted mere hours. Just because somebody's gonna ask me to do this and I'm just gonna go ahead and do it. This is Sparta! The discipline and training of the Spartans did little to stem the tide of the merciless barbarians. The soldiers faced a massacre, while their young captain faced the end of his brilliant career and his life. But to Kratos, victory was worth any price, even his soul. Ares! Destroy my enemies, and my life is yours! That desperate call for aid would come to haunt Kratos for all his days. By the gods, what have I become? Oh, this isn't the scene I was gonna say. Did somebody call for a god of war? All right, well, um, so we got a, another look into Kratos's dark, dark past. And I, well, let's keep on going here and see if maybe, just maybe, we end up where we need to be. Oh, and yes, we do. We're back in the rings of Pandora, but now we have the Architect's Son's Skull. But we're going to go ahead and take a quick break. When we get back, we will continue on in Pandora's Temple. Eventually, this wall will do something. I'm I not sure what, but I, it will. I do not take my eyes off it, because it will do something in the blink of an eye. It, it did something! Welcome back to God of War, everybody. We are continuing on in Pandora's Temple. Thankfully, we don't have to deal with this again. We just have to deal with uh, occasional waves of monsters. Boom! Don't you feel like we're like in the Temple of Doom or something? Yes. Or one of those Except great... with less bugs. I haven't seen Temple of Doom, but I already know one, one thing about it. Like, there's one particular room... I've seen in TV syndication, and that's the room that the girl ends up in with bugs, like lots of bugs. That's why I won't see Temple of Doom. That and the whole heart pulling out thing. And the fact that it's not necessarily the best indie, indie movie ever, so. Just a thing. It's not gonna happen. As much as Andrea wants me to, it's not happening. Sorry. Oh no! room is sealed off. What do we do? You would sort the skull key in the lock. Okay, that's what we do. Ah, crap! Speaking of Indy, I did not think this was funny. Oh, I can't remember how you do that. Like, did we have to jump up? Is there a ladder to climb, or... I'm not sure if we have to break it or not, but... I thought maybe there's a ladder you climbed up, I thought. I think we have to actually get the ladder to come down through this event. Oh no, there you, there you go, stairs. And what will this do? Oh, there's the ladder. See, we have to knock it down. It's out of reach. Oh, yeah, don't you have to get on it and then uh, ra run with it? We're going to do a log ride. This is going to be fun, right, everybody? This is going to be fun? I hope so. It's got to be fun, right? 
Great else, this is gonna be fun, right? Quiet, you mortal! Screw you. Alright, here it comes. Here comes the log ride. You know, for a death trap, this might be fun. If it wasn't a death trap. Eh. 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 There we go. We got it. We did it, Andrea. We are awesome. And now we have a ladder. And. No more boulder to deal with. You know, you could have removed that sonar. I don't know why I speak in a dragful voice. That's not a thing for this game. Hi there, I'm Drakfu. I punch things. They fall down, they die. And Andrea's giving me that look of... What the crap are you talking about? Well, I am talking about the tale of Drakfu. The video that uploads every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Cheap plug. Ahoy. Yeah. You just heard it here. Andrea doesn't want me to cheap plug anymore. Not even to our Let's Plays that are go that go up every Tuesday morning. That silence is the sound of Andrea murdering murdering me. <laughs> yeah. The challenge of Poseidon. Oh wait. I know what's coming. Oh, hi, it's a cute and cuddly puppy. It's a puppy. Except the one thing you don't know is it's a murder death puppy. Hi, Fluffy. Oh yeah, don't you usually have to kill the puppies before they- Yes. So, uh, I have a feeling I'm going to get a bunch of angry comments on this one. Yes, I'm a puppy murderer. Just the thing I have to do, people. Otherwise, they grow into full-on Cerberuses, and we don't want that. And at the same time, we also need to take care of the active Cerberus that's here. It's all right. We took out one of his heads. Eventually, these puppies will stop spawning. Ah! Screw you! Oh, no. Oh, boy. I gotta kill the puppies now. Otherwise, one of them will become a Cerberus. Yeah, we don't need that. However, the Cerberus in Final Fantasy VIII is actually quite helpful. One of the few compliments I will actually hand out to Final Fantasy VIII. I have a feeling I'm going to need this stone block, so I'm just going to take it with me. Yeah, especially if it's sitting right there. Seriously, man, where's my bag of holding? Screw you. Oh, screw you. Like that. Okay, one of them is down. I just barely realized we are we get to look at their butt crack if we yeah, if we turn this camera right. Yep. Please hope that the Sar the Cyclops here do not fart on us. Or that they're actually like the X-Men Cyclops and are a total douche. Seriously, if you are a fan of Cyclops from the X-Men movies, I don't know how you do it. I can't stand the guy. He drives me crazy. I thought you never liked him. No, I don't. I never liked Cyclops from the X-Men. He's a douche! I knew you were gonna call him that. He is! Like... You've only seen him in the TV series, okay? 
In the comics, he is way worse. In the comics, he has been told by Professor Xavier to lighten up. The guy who continues to tout that mutants are good people. Okay, screw you guys. I'm just a killing you. There we go. Let's continue on in Pandora. Oh no, puppies! Puppies must murder puppies! Puppies! I'm gonna get an angry letter from PETA, aren't I? Pretty much. But I'm not trying to be mean to the puppies. They want to murder me. Andrea can attest to that, right? The puppies want to murder me. Murder puppies! Murder puppies! Can you open up now? Of course not. It. No. Murder death puppies! Must murder the puppies! Yeah. I'm getting angry letters after this part. I think it's fairly safe to say. And with this, we pull the lever, Kronk. We get the red chest. No! Uh oh. I got greedy. I got greedy. What were you trying to do after you got that chest? I was trying. I was trying to open up the chest, and and then I got stuck. Oh. What did you have your eyes closed? Don't do that. Okay, can I make this work? Run! Woohoo! Got it. I am awesome. I am awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome! Give me my time. No! <laughs> Man. Screw you guys, I'm a gang hank. It's like if you don't hit it at the right time when you first start, you're less likely you to. You are screwed, roughly, yes. Because it looked like you didn't get, get a hold of the second chest. Well, you, you basically have to take advantage of every second that you get in that puzzle. So we're going to do it again, and I'm going to show you. Okay, open up the chest. Run! If you so much as do this a second wrong, it will not work. Yeah, that's why I'm saying. It's like... There we go. Woo. That's two. Give me another chest. <laughs> yeah, baby. Oh, uh, and here's another red chest. Okay, we got it. Will this be the one that leads to an actual place? Nope, there's a chest. Oh, okay, good. Grab some magic. Destroy some pottery because that's what we do. Oh, these guys. So these guys are not fun because you can't really use the juggling combo against them. You actually have to contend with them. These are the equivalent of uh, evil Spartans. Guys who know what they're doing. So much so that they actually require two glory kills to kill. Just 
just go ahead and do a little bit of extra damage on him. Ding, 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 ding. Screw you. Really? Are we playing this game? Screw you. Stab you right in the back with your own arm and your own sword. That's the way it goes. Oh, that's right. I actually have to use these. There we go. We're doing some mountain climbing, Andrea. We're awesome like that. This is actually one of those things that I think God of War does really, really well. Scale. Mm -hmm. um, everything looks bigger than you. Everything looks titanic. Um, <laughs> it looks titanic. like... Eh, 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 and I got a fuse key for it, so that's awesome. Every, yeah, everything looks bigger than you. Everything looks like it's built for the gods, the titans, whomever. That's a great thing to, to showcase. Is Congratulations. Welcome to a world that is... Full of titans and myth. Uh, is there another thing that we need to go up for? I don't think so, but... What happens if I go this way? Uh, I might get slapped by the chain? I don't know. Oh, hi, Crota uh, hi, hi, Kronos. How you doing? Not good, mortal. Stupid minotaurs! Okay. Say ah. There we go. Say ah. <laughs> Mister, I'm having one of those weird days, people. Yeah, pretty much. I've been recording all week, all day, all that. The only the only break I've had from recording has been to go take my daughter to the doctor. That's what happened. Uh, No, not because she was sick, but she had her in No, there, there, are such a th there are such things as checkups. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this actually puts me in a new room with magic. So I'll take that. Step into the light, Kratos, and then you know that you have saved the game, and that is awesome. There we go. Step into the fountain. Oh. The fountain of youth. Here are my aching feet. Oh, what's this? All these Spartans. What? Okay, so let's continue on, even though we have a bunch of Spartans. Crank is missing its handle. Oh, so we need the we need the handle. Where's the handle? We actually need to take it off that Atlas statue? I don't think so, but it's entirely possible. Maybe if I kill all these statues, that'll do it. Or actually, I have a feeling I know what I need to do. That's not it. Do I actually need to bring one of them down? I think so, but it's entirely possible.
Well, I've officially killed off... Well, not every statue. Now I've killed off every statue. 